Welcome. Uh, we're here at uh, Restaurant 11 Madison Park. I'm Daniel Holm. I'm the chef here. And as you see, we're getting ready for the holidays. What I want to show you is how to best carve a turkey and also what knife are best to use. You're going to need a meat fork. Then also I recommend to use a boning knife. You're going to use that to remove the legs and the breast. And then last, a slicer. That will help you to get really uh, thin slices of the breast. Well, we start with the fork in one hand and uh, the boning knife in the other hand. The fork we kind of use to uh, stabilize the turkey so it doesn't move around. And then with the boning knife, we're going to start remove the legs. What I like about the boning knife is that you kind of can feel where the bones are so you don't cut in them. And between the breast and the leg, there is a little gap. If your knife is really nice and sharp, you really don't need to put a lot of pressure. This is uh, one leg and the other side, we do it uh, just the same way. The breast uh, has a little bone in the middle and uh, you're gonna go slightly on one side of the bone uh, for the one breast and slightly on the other side of the bone uh, for the other breast. You start moving your knife a little bit around it and you're doing the exact same thing on the other side. Uh, you use the fork to stabilize the turkey. You cut slowly on, on this side and it takes maybe six, seven cuts until you kind of feel that your knife is hitting the bottom here. And you can fold it down and it almost folds down by itself. Okay, now we're gonna cut the legs first. And again, we're still using the boning knife. And with this knife, you actually can feel where in between the bone is a little softer. And uh, here, you have uh, the drumstick where everybody is going to fight over it. And then over here, you have the top part of the leg. And here, I just like to cut them along the bone. And maybe you cut it one more time so it's not too big. Then for the breast, we use the slicing knife. And before we use it, we want to make sure uh, it's sharp. I recommend to just use the steel for like two or three strokes and just on both sides. And that way also we can make sure that the skin uh, doesn't rip. And we cut it a little bit on a bias and it doesn't take a lot of pressure, just kind of slowly uh, go through the skin and then cut the meat. I like to serve it family style with all the, you know, side dishes. And I want to show you one plate. We're going to use a little bit of the breast here and a piece of the leg, so you have some dark meat as well. And for sides, we have some brioche raisin stuffing, some cranberries here, some Brussels sprouts as well with a little bacon. We have some sweet potatoes. And then of course, in the end, uh, we finish with a little gravy. Remember, the key to carving your turkey properly are the right tools and sharp knives and of course uh, great recipes. Please enjoy your holidays.